sure this is Miss Anna Loves. So anyway guys, how are you all doing? How is everything? How are your goals for 2019 going so far? Are you reaching them? Are you taking baby steps? Are you kind of like putting them aside and doing something else? Let me know down in the comments below. Anyway, today I'm going to be showing you the beauty formulas with activated charcoal mask designed to bubble and foam upon application to help clean and clarify leaves skin feeling fresh and revitalized detoxifying bubble mask i purchased this in poundland for a pound and hopefully it's still nice and wet because it's been ages anyway yes it is Ooh, it's bubbling up already inside it has a fragrance to it, it reminds me of rose it's mild it's very saturated Wow, it feels almost slimy. I'm just hoping it, look at that. It's absolutely drenched in products. Oh, yep, yeah, thanks, drenching all over my clothes. Right, when it's like this, it's very, very wet. Be very careful that it doesn't tear. Because the last thing you want is a rip mask and I have to like kind of Rubik's Cube this mask open because I don't want to be pulling out anything that's Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I don't know if there is a right way. So I always try and look for something that looks like it's the inside and I apply it on my face like that. The scent is actually quite pleasant. I quite like it. It reminds me of roses. So you know what I look like? You know like you get them see them people that you know like their the hairy face. It feels really satisfying. Oh my gosh, it feels nice and satisfying. I don't know. It's got like yeah, 15 minutes. You okay, 15 minutes are up. As you can see, it's it's still bubbling actually. I mean, I don't know how much more bubbles you can get from this, but it's had like probably 18 minutes on my face, so it's due to take it off. Um, throughout it, you can smell the nice rose scent. It's quite faint, but it's quite very pleasant as well this is soapy so you cannot rub this in your face it's very silky silky smooth and it's full it does feel nice but it does feel like yeah it's a soap so um, I would suggest that you do not rub this in your face so I'm gonna to the bathroom and I'll be back okay I'm back face wash, blah, face rinsed off and pat dry it took a while to take the bubbles off because it's like there's so much soap. So you have to really give this, your face a really good wash. Don't skimp people because you don't really want that residue of soap on your face because it's not that type of mask. But because it is a soapy type, it's, it's completely new to me. It's new territory. I've never had a mask where it was... I didn't expect that. I just thought, you know, you have bubbles, but it'll feel more like... Your normal mask that you get in the shop my first thoughts on it i love how it bubbled up it was really really nice i love how silky soft it was um i didn't like the fact that i had to fiddle with it a bit too long to try and get it and then somebody said okay maybe try and tuck it under i don't know if i caught that on camera i kind of tucked it under and obviously because it's so wet and it is quite fragile you don't want to get frustrated and end up tearing the mask that's the last thing you want also the mask is a good size in my other videos i haven't really mentioned that but some masks are quite are shorter than others and some of them are really good fit so you can really put the mask right over your face as opposed to just stopping here mind you please guys breathe through your mouth because a couple of times i've been my nose and I can feel the bubbles slowly going up there as it's drying feels really smooth it uh, I'm just feeling it it does feel quite smooth but also at the same time I can feel that it's actually drying out my face also um, and I like stuff that keeps my face hydrated I have a actually I have a pretty normal skin I do have combination but my combination is very minute so the oily part is my nose just on this part of my nose hair and here I don't know if you can see there's a little bit here and a little bit here where are there are my driest patches I want to go and put some moisturizer on my face straight away because it's that kind of uncomfortable dry light yeah I got dry skin that is how it feels but before I uh, before I go and moisturize my face I'm going to use the pumpkin and papaya enzyme daily exfoliator skin resurfacing and promoting radiance and that's by botanical lab but I'm just going to put it on a cotton pad and I'm just gonna wipe my face with it then I'm going to apply the Nip and Fab Hydrate Dragon's Blood Fix Hypoquotic Shot. And I put a few 
pumps of my Nip and Fab Fixes Needle Serum. Anyway guys, I've come to the end of this review. If you like this video, you know exactly what to do. Please guys, support this channel by subscribing to my channel. I have loads of things coming up in 2019. I don't know what they are yet, but I do know that I have loads. So guys, until my next video, I shall see you later. Bye.